Hello, this is Carrie Ling. I am speaking on behalf of those who can no longer speak for themselves and for the very many who will soon be unable. Every day thousands of people around the world are given the worst possible diagnosis, amyotrophic lateral sclerosis or ALS, also known as Lou Gehrig's disease. On any given day over 30,000 Americans are coping with ALS. As the disease progresses each person will lose the ability to move, the ability to speak, the ability to eat, and eventually the ability to breathe. The average lifespan after diagnosis is between 2 and 5 years although many live only 18 months. Unlike injury to the spine, those affected by ALS continue to experience sensation. That means they can experience pain but not move to avoid it or ask anyone for help. The mind is very rarely affected so the person is acutely aware of their deterioration as they are slowly trapped in the prison of their own body. There is no relief from the daily and inexorable horror that is ALS. Not only are individuals affected but whole families are destroyed by the effort and expense required to support their loved one and by their eventual loss. Approximately 10% of cases are caused by inherited genetic mutation and only a few of those have been identified. 90% of cases are sporadic, with no known cause. And it is being identified in younger and younger people some as young as 16. This means it can happen to you. You have a roughly 1 in 100,000 chance of being diagnosed with ALS. There is no exercise, no diet, no lifestyle choice that can prevent this tragedy. Despite being a recognized condition for over 100 years there is no treatment which can slow progression of ALS. More research is desperately needed to discover the cause and develop effective treatments. Time is in very short supply for the people currently affected and for those who will be diagnosed tomorrow. You can still help. To learn more about ALS and to support the world's only nonprofit laboratory devoted solely to research and treatment of ALS, go to www.als.net. To support people currently afflicted with ALS, go to alsguardianangels.com. Again, to learn more, www.als.net to support patients alsguardianangels.com you can also help by sending this message to your friends and by talking with them about ALS help me to be a voice for those who have lost theirs thank you for your support